Hello, my Porto Valet. Just thought I'd give you a Viper van walk around or more of a step inside, really. Let's uh, have a look how my van is set up. See, see if you can see how I, how I work, what I work out of. See my uh, generator, which needs to be powerful to operate my Kranzel K7 pressure washer. Um, you can see uh, all my boxes full of brushes, various areas of the vehicle, uh, microfiber cloths, uh, buffing cloths, microfibers, polishing pads, tapes. I've got my blower, drying towels is the only ones I use. Really big, soak up a lot of water, very soft. Yeah, really good. I've tried a few different ones, but they're the ones I've found the best and just keep buying them. Um, various little bits and pieces I find really helpful through the day. A little uh, battery powered blower, and I find that very useful. A couple of hand tools, a few electric power tools, spare wash mitts. Wash buckets and a brush organizer for wheels. Find that most handy. Same to keep dunking my hand in the bucket, finding little brushes when I'm doing wheels. Really helpful. And over this side, and up the top, got my uh, polishes, waxes, sealants, various little bits and pieces that help me through the day. Leather care, all that kind of stuff. And I've got the products that I use on a daily basis, APC, TFR, tire and glue remover, uh, detail sprays, spray waxes, um, all the stuff that's just used all the time. I've got my other products, strong wheel cleaners, uh, iron fallout, bug removers, and I've got my top ups. Um, you know, to make sure they don't run out during the day or over a couple of days. Um, various other bits and pieces just make life easier. Uh, make sure I've got everything I need. Got my trolley jack, uh, axle stands, do wheel off removal so that I can do a full decontamination on arches and wheels. Um, done a few of those now, really beneficial. I'll just take you uh, into the side door. There you can see my water tank, uh, 350 litres. Um, boxed it in just to make it more convenient. I've got sick and tired of bungees and ratchet straps, and it didn't really work very well, and found them untidy. This was a much better option. Um, got my George, wet and dry. Really good tool, very useful, reliable. Um, got my uh, utensils for the, the George vac wet dry machine, all nicely um, up and out of the way. A new acquisition, um, little compressor. Uh, so I can use various tools, inflate tyres, use the blow gun. Um, a real benefit, new new tool I'm going to get for the valeting and detailing. I needed the compressor for that, so um, yeah, definitely had to get one. Golf clubs have gone. This just makes more sense. Only installed that yesterday. Just want to put uh, another shelf in there, just again, uh, keep things neat and tidy. Makes things much easier when you're looking for things and you know where it is. And it looks more professional when the van's laid out well. Um, dust pan and brush. Don't use it very often, but it's handy when I do. My Viper plates so that when I've finished a valet or a detail, I can take some photos, upload them, but cover up the, the client's number plate, a bit of security. Just step inside the van now. Again, 
generator extension leads and my metro vac blower really essential when you're trying to dry out door shuts engine bays um, provides a complete in a, a valet or a detail or getting ready to wax or polish or ceramic coat it make sure the cars as dry as can be possible come round you can see uh, Number of my wheel brushes, wheel arch brushes. Yeah. There you go, all nice, neat, and tidy. Everything labelled. Yeah. Okay. I think that gives you a bit of an insight.